know where you are. This is Nollywood Pictures too. Now that we have taken the pens and completed the whole sacrifices, what am I expecting to see my daughter back home? Oh, exactly. I actually wanted to ask this question at the riverside, but I said, okay, no, let me just wait till we get to the temple. Let it not be like uh, I'm too inquisitive. Hmm? Yeah? Dad, Jehovah! Mama! Dad, Jehovah! We've done our part. Let us allow Abala to do his own work. He knows what to do. Exactly. This is what I'm talking about. Eh? Why, why is what is I don't know. Which one are you? Which one is Agbala Agbala? Anytime you are talking, you keep referring to Agbala Agbala. Eh? Is it Agbala you are serving or God? Let it not be like. What I'm thinking, though. Um, I'm, I'm sorry if I get you angry, but get you angry. Yes, I did. And let this be the last time you talk to me in such manner because I am always surrounded by Agbala. No, see, it's, it's, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. But at least we need to know. Which side we are? Is yes. it Agbala or God? Let no, let us not be in between these people or one. So I want to really know which one. Is it God or Agbala? We are serving. Yes. Agbala. I sacrifice my love only to be accused of what I know nothing about. I sacrificed my love oh, only to be accused of what I know nothing about. I beg to eat, but they don't care to know. Yes, in a merry, I come on the water. And poor on a man, and a bar of my cabe, I come on the water, or be moved the water. Ah, 
Yes, Papa, I saw him and he talked about Rose. And if I know any of her friends that comes around to see her, whether at the shop or in our house. So do you know who or who that is her friend? Um, whether the person is from this village or... Do you have any of their numbers? <laughs> no, no. Uh, even if the person is not from this village, eh, we can still go there and see them. Oh, talk now! Oh, 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 do you, wait first, wait. Do you know eh, somebody that knows who might know her? Something like that. Papa, I don't understand all these questions. Eh? I see I'm in, in, in exam hall. Wait, guys. So I'm not a guy. I talk. 
you are you are you are, you, you, you are telling us as if we are questioning you as if you are in exam hall. Eh? So you, you cannot even know friends of your sister. You stay with your sister all these years. Oh. So are you saying that you've not okay, let's even say phone call. Have you heard her make phone call with anybody before? Or, or do you have her phone number? Papa, I don't know any person. The only person I know is only the pastor that used to come to the house and she shares her problem with him and apart from the pastor, I don't know any, I don't know any other or, person. Or, 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 or do you have any of her friend's number that you can call the friend, the, maybe the friend not call her? But I don't or, have any... Or, or, do, or do you, for instance, she might be making a call oh. and you are standing by. Hello, Stella, I can hear you. That kind of it is. Did you hear any name that she called when she was making calls? Papa, is no, any... I don't. I don't know any person apart from that pastor. I don't have any clue. I don't know any person. I don't know. Oh, oh, okay. Is there any of her friend compliments? Compl uh, um, 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 complimentary. Complimentary card. But I have no. That I... you might pick somewhere and kept all this while you don't have it. I've not seen any person. Okay, so are you know. wait? Are you saying that even as she's in the house? People don't come in to set things for her, you know. You women, they will bring bags, you know, yeah. dresses, perfumes, uh, make foundation. You know why we are doing this is because uh, it's just for the interest of Rose and Ikenma. Okay. They might solve the subject. What kind of sister do you have? That you don't know anything. So you just stay, that's how all you do is to eat food. You don't know anything about the person you are living with? Papa, Isn't no, it? I don't I don't know any person apart from that pastor. I don't have any clue. I don't know any person. I don't Every day, pastor, pastor. What do you have with that pastor? Only the pastor you know. All these questions, eh? Well, why are all these questions? I don't know any person. If I know, I would have told you people now, eh? The person you are living with, you don't know any associate of her. I don't know, I don't know. What kind of person are you, sir? If we have this number, if you had given us numbers, at least we would have called our, our, our son. I no, no, no. sacrifice my love only to be accused of what I know nothing about. I sacrifice my love oh, only to be accused of what I know nothing about.
Um, I summoned this meeting for us to try to provide a solution to the problem we have at hand. I strongly believe that uh, Ruth is no longer alive. Yes. So as such, we need to find a way to meet our in-laws, Ekena and family, and uh, try to map out modalities to mourn her you know, in line with our tradition before our son goes back to his base. Na Naturally, I disagree with you. Fine, we can go and see Ekena in his house. But when we get there, let us not be the first to announce the death of, the, of their daughter. Let us keep quiet and wait for them to say it. When they bring up the topic, when it will be. As for our son going back to his base. Eh -eh. The problem is not just the death of Rose, but also that he is involved in the death. Sister, Sister Rose is not dead. I can't believe she is dead. I can't believe that. My mind is telling me that she's still alive. I one day I'm going to see her again. Bejonu! Who asked you to speak? Huh? By the way, uh, Inne Julius, who, who asked you to, to, to invite this little brat to a meeting of elders? Papa, 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 please calm down, okay? She only said her mind. Don't ask me to calm down! Eh? What does she know? After all, she's been living with Rose all these years. But she has not been able to identify a single friend of Rose. Asking me to calm down. Papa Julius, just calm down. This is a meeting. We are all expressing our feelings, saying our minds. She's not bad. I had the I had the heart. Well, anyway, uh, Odile. Tomorrow morning, you are going to call um, Echendo for me. Mm -hmm. Tell him uh, you should see me for us to have discussion over this matter. It's not only Echendo. You have to call some of your other kinsmen. Uh, let Echendo come first. Then uh, we can discuss internally on how we're going to move. Then later we can invite the other people. Pastor, I know that you would take up your disturbances now that you're back. Sister Rose, please try and understand me. See, I made a vow to you that I will not tell anyone about my place. I also made a vow to the Almighty God that I will not lie to anyone in my life. Sister Rose, your father needs you. Your brother is restless. And Julius and the entire villagers have been searching for you endlessly. Pastor, there you go again. If I was in the mad people's home, would they need me the most now? What if I had died? I cannot even stand my husband face to face. Not after contaminating my matrimonial bed with, with his hard lot of a friend, Susan. Where do I start from? Tell me, Pastor. Uh, Sister Rose, I mean your father's house. Pastor, he sent me out in the middle of the night with my little boy, his grandson, not minding. What if I had died that night? What would have been his fate by now? This world is so wicked. It's not a good place to live in. The 
is my bag. Take it and keep it outside. Then I will understand I am no longer welcome. I promise I would live with my little boy and we would not to stop you again. Take it, Pastor. Pastor, I called you regarding one of our daughters who is a member of your church. Her name is Rose. From the information I gathered, she was last seen in your church. Would you know anything about her whereabouts? Because she's now missing. You speak the truth, Igwe. I don't know her whereabouts myself. As I speak with you now, I've asked all the members of my church and the answer they gave to me is not favorable at all regarding her whereabouts, Your Majesty. I did not want to call you on the telephone because uh, this kind of matter to be handled. I'd like you to know that I am not just the traditional ruler of this community. I am also a retired DIG of police. From the information I gathered, you are Rose's only friend in this village. Not just that, you are also a pastor. Yes, Your Majesty. Good. You told Ekena, Rose's father, that she was taking refuge in your church. But she left with no trace, Your Majesty. Hold on. Someone told you she had left or you discovered it yourself. the question uh, yes someone someone your majesty no I, I i i i discovered it myself that she's no longer in the church premises your majesty mm. you were seeing her in that church taking refuge or someone told you I saw her myself, Your Majesty. And when you did that, did you take your time to inform her father, her parents, that Rose was taking refuge in your church? Knowing that she was missing, and you were looking for her? No, Your Majesty. I, I didn't know she was missing and they were searching for her. You are a pastor. man of God. Look me in the eyes when I speak with you. Talk to me as you will speak as a representative of God before your congregation. Where is my daughter and her child? I'm sure you know them.
I'm fine now. Please, that rat poison you gave me the other day, it uh, didn't work. Oh. I don't understand. I used it and it didn't kill any rat in the house. As a matter of fact, all the rats are still disturbing. Yeah. Sorry about that. Eh? Hmm? It must be one of those fake insecticides that is food in the market. I think I will return the remaining ones to them and get my refund. Please, do you have another one I can buy? Yes, I have. This one is more costly and very active. It can kill any living thing instantly. Please, can I have it? <laughs> this is the best of them all. This very one is the original ones in the market. It can kill and very active. Please follow the instruction here very carefully before making use of it because it is very harmful. Even the smell alone can kill human being. How much is this particular one? It's supposed to be 1,500, but because of the complaint, I'll give it to you 1,300. Remember what I just told you. Follow the instruction, please. It is very helpful. Yeah? Okay. Oh, this change. Uh, put this one. Whenever you are passing, no, 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 no problem. Don't worry. Uh, I know that you're tired of me staying with you in your house. Ah, no doubt you, sister. I'm just reconsidering my vow that I made to Almighty God never to lie. And what happens to your promise to shelter me without anyone knowing? Sister Rose, your father and the entire community will never be happy with me. He finds out that you're my case and I hid it from them. Since all this while after searching for you. So? Let's do it in a stylish way. Stylish way. Yes. How? By telling your father. Or what do you call it? Betrayal. Or don't you think so? Sister Rose, for how long will you be hiding from your father? Until God's time, Pastor. Pastor, you will do no such thing. It is for your own good, Sister Rose. Trust me.
What have I done? Such an innocent woman. Man of God! Good afternoon, sir. Oh, good afternoon. Yes, please, sir. Good afternoon, yeah, sir. Good afternoon. May God bless you. Amen. Mm -hmm. um, please, there is something I want to tell you. What about it? It's about uh, Sister Rose. Yes. She came here and purchased a, a rat poison, an insect said. To my own surprise, after a few minutes, she came back telling me that. Uh, the exercise did not work, it did not kill anything. So I don't understand what she did. So is that why you stopped me that you want to tell me something? Uh, yes, sir. I was thinking maybe you might know something about it. Oh, please wait. Oh my god! Are you kidding me? Oh my god, please, I'm not done here, please! Let me finish explaining.
but it will take my life. I will join you. to me that she had suffered in the hands of everyone, including her own biological father. Everyone rejected her and tagged her as a mad woman. So with this and some other things that I may not be able to tell you now, she swore that over her dead body will she set eyes with her father or any of her husband's family again. So I swore to keep her secretly in my house. But days back I summoned the courage to go and tell her husband about her whereabouts. But when I got there, I was carried away with what I saw, so I didn't remember to tell her husband again, Your Majesty. Now, are you sure she is still alive and in your house as we speak right now? Yes, Your Majesty, with a child. Your Majesty, it might be difficult for him to believe me. He may, he may target another thing entirely, Your Majesty. When you get there, calm down. And then, narrate everything to him, just as you have done here. Everything. All right, Your Majesty. Thank you, Your Majesty. I have my eyes on you. that she's alive. That is step one.
is this close? Don't tell me it's this sad. Please cheer up. You see, the Bible says, They that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. Please, throw it. Sister Rose is the best for you, please. It's okay, my daughter. Please, it's okay. Hi, Sister Rose, please. Please. Forgive him, please. Stayed long enough in this room. Console yourself. That is life for you. to commit suicide. Susan is in jail. If I were you, I would stand up and forgive. God has vindicated you. Rise and shine again. Think of yourself. Think of this little boy of yours. Think of the future. Eh? I've told him to come back tomorrow. They should leave and never come back. Should go, they should leave me alone. There is no smoke without fire. I'm sure. We all know who caused the problem. Susan. Because she was bent on causing confusion and disunity in Okeke's family. Now, where did it land her? Life imprisonment. Life imprisonment. Why would somebody be so wicked? Anyway, I beg of you, as it is like this, please accept Okeke and his family back. Eh? So that there can be peace. Our people usually say that there is no peace without war. Now, you have fought all the wars and now peace has returned. In all this, you won. Your son won. And your daughter has climaxed everything. So I beg of you, accept them. I know that you always uh, listen to my words and take my advice. Uh, this one will not be different. <clears throat> Your Majesty. Thank you so much. I've had you. But, um, I have to go home and sleep over this issue. Because our people say that he who is fast in accepting things might accept what he's supposed to refuse. And he who is fast in refusing things might refuse what he ought to have accepted. So please, I want to go home and sleep and think over this. <laughs> this
This is why I always say you are the true son of your father. <laughs> Thank you very much. Uh, um, let's take our leave. All right, there is no more. Thank you. I'm my son. <laughs> no fighting again, eh? Oh. <laughs> My in-laws, you are welcome. I ask you people to come today for us to discuss on what to do for my daughter Rose. You see, in life we make mistakes. But the worst thing is not correcting our mistakes. I have decided to forgive and prevail on Rose to forgive too. No, he's referring to her spirit. Her spirit? No, I'm referring to her flesh. Pastor, tell them. Well, this is the Lord's doing, and it is marvelous in our eyes. On that fateful day, Hold on, you've not even allowed me to finish explaining things to you. Explain what? What are you explaining about that you sold a sniper to her? A poison? Sir, it's not what you think. That very day, I saw her around your house. And when I saw her, I noticed she was into some trouble. So when she demanded for the sniper, I went inside and took an empty can of sniper, filled it with some mixture. So when she saw it, she believed that it's original sniper. Yes, and... That mixture is a capable of indulging one into sleep. And it knocks one off instantly. Oh. Yes. Are you sure of what you're saying? Very sure, sir. Oh. Glory be to the Almighty God. Listen to me. Do not tell anyone this, okay? Trust me. Good. Oh. You can go now. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Then I went to Julius' house and tried to inform him to come with me. But that was the same day he attempted suicide. Um, from that day, we done everything quietly. But the most important thing is that my daughter, Rose, and her son, Ikenna, are still alive. She portrayed back in their house. 
Will I say that she is not happy seeing me? Or has the hatred she has for me risen to this level? No. She is still my wife and she said it in the presence of everybody. I don't mind if they say I should do the wine carrying over again. Rose. Rose. Thank God that you are not there but alive for me. My people like greet you all. Well, today marks the end of the um, war and trauma between the KK family and uh, Ekenna's family. Today, finally, the peace and unity that should reign between them has, has been restored. And we have our daughter Rose here and her husband. It is because of them that we are here. We want to bring them back together. Isn't it, my people? It's true. Right. Uh, so, it's now. Igwe, the ball is in your court. Um, with regards to your advice, which you have carried out, I've handed everything over to God. I cannot sit here and tell you what Akachuku, my son, and I went through in looking for my daughter. Putting legs in between life and death. But all the same, glory be to God. Um, my daughter Rose, he who loves last, loves best. But let this not repeat itself again. Uh, Umban, it can never repeat itself. Uh, I have learned my lesson. And um, in short, all of us, we've learned our lessons. Mm? So it won't repeat itself again. <clears throat> Your Majesty, my people, today is... Um, the happiest day in my life. I want to say a very big thank you to everyone here present. And also a big thank you to the pastor who saved my life and did lots of contributions. My wife and I have nothing much to say. I'm happy today that she has forgiven me and also put the past behind us. Thank you very much. No doubt, Julia's here, was my husband and the father to my son, Ikena. I have forgiven him and I have put everything in the past. But I will not forget all I went through in the hearts of Julius and his family. Igwe, they can take Ikena because he's still their son. I, Rosalie, I will never live with Julius as a husband and wife. Not after everything I went through. They say it is good for every woman 
to taste marriage. Get married and live with your husband. But instead of marriage to kill me, I would rather kill the marriage. My king, I'm very sorry. I am not trying to rubbish your efforts gathering all of us to your palace. But please, allow me to follow my heart as God has led me. Rose has a point here. A very good point for that matter. Oh yes, this man. Why are you always a spoiler? Eh? She has a point that she's going to leave my family or what? Which point are you talking about? But, but do you, you hear her point? Since this matter started, you've been the one putting fear and, and, and putting fire. This is serious. Ibu. Ibu. Ibu, please. I don't know. If you can permit me to talk to my wife. I mean our wife. Uh, uh, your Majesty. The, the wind has already blown, the foul animals have been seen. What is the need for this secret meeting again? Whatever she has to, she can say it here. Um, the thing is that uh, the women is usually have their secrets. Maybe there are some things they need to talk about. Allow her, go with her. Let's go. She says she's leaving my son, and you are saying she has a point. Which point? Instead of it to repair, you are always destroying. Me? Yes! She made a Personally ashamed and sorry for everything we have done to you. Become my daughter. Forgive us. We were acting on forces that were beyond us. Please don't leave us. See, eh? henceforth, I will start treating you like my own daughter. I will do whatever you want me to do for you. Please don't leave us. Be gone. Forgive us. You know, as a woman, there's not much I can say in the presence of the Igwe and his cabinet. That was why I decided to bring you out. Forgive my family. If you leave us, we will not be as united and the way we are. You want to dry your tears, oh? Dry your tears, one. Dry your tears. The people don't leave us in home. Thank you.
we we have talked and the future looks greater and she has agreed to put everything behind her Oh. Igwe, like they say, if someone is into any particular business and is not yielding anything good, he or she stands the right to change that business. That proverb is confusing. Take very good care of him. For Miriam, it is only God in heaven that will bless her for me. But in our next generation, I would love for us to appreciate our wives. Trust them. Papa. My love. Brother Kachi. Thank <laughs> you. 
Agenda. How could I know? 